Hey, hey guys, another car vlog. So I'm going to answer a question that was put to me on YouTube with regards to a student, soon to be a professional developer's career path, or at least his path to getting into a career. So his teacher told him that he should learn OOP, object-oriented programming, and the basics of MVC before jumping into a framework like Laravel. He was talking about PHP, but these lessons apply to any programming language of course whether it be ruby python java etc etc now learning a framework is a great thing because besides the fact you're learning a tool that, could, that you can use to be very productive it also helps you to better understand how to implement mvc as an example mvc is a design pattern it's a way of organizing apps it also shows you how object-oriented programming is implemented in a real world type of app situation at least it shows you one way now the good thing about frameworks like laravel or django or java spring etc etc ruby rails is that you're seeing a mature implementation meaning you're seeing a mature way of doing it because these frameworks have been around quite a bit and they've been worked on by hundreds of developers probably and thousands of developers have worked with them such that they're highly refined they figured out what they did wrong they uh, w took out what was wrong they put what was what was good in there so it's kind of cool that way but before really you could fully understand any of these frameworks you have to at least understand the basics of object-oriented programming that's that's a given you have to understand the basic concepts. You should be comfortable with creating objects, using inheritance, and basically writing, you know, I'm not gonna get into it here, but basically writing object-oriented code. You should be comfortable with at least the basic concepts. And in terms of MVC, just do a simple MVC-based tutorial where you run through a project where you see it implemented. And once you've just, you know, this is not a lot of work. Once you've done that, then you can jump into whatever, framework you want to jump into for php i would recommend laravel for java spring for python django for most people etc uh, etc et so uh well you know ruby rails although i wouldn't do that right now javascript node yeah so yes that's my suggestion so it's a bit of a judgment call but just so that you're comfortable with object-oriented programming you're comfortable with mvc then you'll be ready to get into an MVC framework. That's pretty much my advice regards to that. So you're looking just like a few days of work, maybe a week of work, and then you can jump to an MVC framework. I hope that makes sense. Bye-bye.